when you go to a restaurant here in Charleston, you make memories with the food, the conversations around the table, and of course, the overall experience. So what better way to keep memories of your dinner than to make a piece of art out of it? Charleston Matchbox makes modern art souvenirs out of all of the matchboxes you take when you're leaving a restaurant. Owner and creative and creator Susan Rukas is here with me to talk about her art and how they're giving back to the local hospitality community. Susan, welcome. Hi, thank you, Emily, so much for inviting me to be on the show today. Of I'm excited course, to be here. Of course, I came across your art on social media a long time ago. Yes. I've been following you for a while. You're I one of the first. <laughs> I love it. Um, I absolutely love your art. Um, thank you. As somebody who is a foodie here in Charleston, go to a lot of restaurants, and it's so nice to have that souvenir um, that you can take home and take, take those memories home with you. Talk to me about how this whole thing got started. Sure. So uh, my husband and I right now above our bar cart, we have an old vintage limited edition Richmond Matchbox poster. So my husband and I are both from Richmond, Virginia. And we um, last year were looking at it, reminiscing about all the memories that we had in our old city. And we we're both like, you know what? Charleston needs something like this. There's nothing like it. Um, it is a culinary scene. We have I think we're like number one in mm -hmm. like tourism. Yeah. So we were like, this could be the perfect way for people to bring Charleston back home with them. Mm -hmm. So we were like, this is do, let's do it. This is it. Yeah. So when it. was that? That was last year. This time. Oh, wow. so this is kind of a newer thing for you guys. Yes, very new. And we luckily, since we've been here for ten years, we had a handful of matches to begin with, because that's the tedious part: is going to all the restaurants, finding the places that actually have them. But um, I also do photography, so I took the photos, and we just kind of went from there. Wow. So how common do you think it is when you go into those restaurants? Um, how common is it that they actually have these match boxes? Not as common as you think. <laughs> like, I feel like back in the day, this was like a very yeah. common thing. Um, but I'm starting to see it becoming like a, a come back, you know, mm -hmm. I think people are wanting to um, sh give a little piece of their restaurant with their uh, customers. So. I know. It's so fun to go and take it and take it home. You're like, oh, there it is. I have one from High Cotton right next to my bed yeah. right now. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice thing to take. All right, you actually brought a yes. piece of your art. Can I you did. Can you show us so sure. people can see what we're talking about? So talk to me about this piece. Um, well, this is our very first poster. Um, it's the Charleston poster. And as you can see, we have um, all of the restaurants in uh, Charleston. We also have some hotels. And um, really, it's just a special piece for people to look at and bring up old memories that people have had. Um, you know, whether it's a an engagement or a bridal shower or um, weddings or anything mm -hmm. like that, we've uh, seen a lot of people commenting on our posts saying, you know, this is a special place to me. We've, um, yeah, so it's just a really great way for people to reminisce on old memories. Yeah, so I see on there, I see Henry's, I see Halls, Rancho <laughs> Lewis, High yes. Cotton, Little Palm. Why these places? Well, they. This is literally every single <laughs> matchbox that you can find in Charleston. So that's one reason. Yeah. Um, honestly, we just wanted to include everyone. This mm -hmm. is there's some downtown. There's yeah. some from Sullivan's. Seabrook, we got. Yeah, Salty we got Dog. Seabrook. Yeah. We got uh, Folly Beach. We have. Um, where is it? Burt's. I'm sure a yeah. lot of people are familiar with that yeah, place. And it's not just this print. You can do custom no. prints. There's all different yes. kinds. Yes, we uh, do custom print. We actually had someone from Chicago just recently reach out to us and I did um, you know, some of her favorite restaurants that she missed when she Aww. moved. And um, I've done a wedding one where I've taken, you know, a place where they got married and then just like a couple more where she had her um, her rehearsal dinner and yeah. stuff like that. So really there's a lot of different ways that you can go about customizing your yeah. print. And now we're getting into the holidays. This is a yes. great holiday gift. I know, it really is. And I've had a ton of people say that. So I'm really excited to see everyone, um, you know, come to me and ask me about what they want for their yes. gifts. <laughs> and how can people order? Uh, you can go to our website. Um, 
it's just charlestonmatchbox.com and there is a custom tab that you have to go to and you just kind of tell me what you want and I will send you a proof uh, or you can just go and buy individuals or the poster as well. So we have a lot of different options on the website. Yeah, talk to me about um, the cause that you guys are supporting with these. Yes, I'm very glad you asked about that because um, when my husband and I were talking about what we like how we could give back to the community um, I've actually worked in the restaurant industry the majority of my young adult life so I uh, was googling different nonprofits and came across pay it forward which is a nonprofit that goes back to um, to people who are in need of money or grants mm -hmm. say for a health problem or something like that and um, yeah, it was a no-brainer to work with them. So I'm really excited that this is our first, or yet yeah, last month was our first month with working with them. Oh. And I can't wait to help them out. Yeah, so a portion of the, the funds go to pay it forward now. Yes. Amazing. Yes. We had cutting boards for a cause on last week, um, and they also support Pay It Forward. We know our hospitality community is such a big part of our community here. They do so much for us. Um, so thank you so much for doing that. Yeah, of And course. plus, you're supporting all these restaurants, but you're I celebrating know. them and all the memories that you can make in all of these places. Yes. Um, it's amazing. Anything else you want to tell people about your art and why you love doing what you do? Um, I guess uh, recently we did a giveaway. Um, I guess it was last month, and um, a lot of people were commenting, so I asked them to share their story about one of their favorite matches or locations on the Matchbox poster, and um, it really just made me feel proud to be doing this because not only like is it fun for me, but I get to like share something with someone that they can, you know, share in their home for many years to talk about all the fun memories that they've had Amazing. in Charleston. So I love that. So many great memories of yes. so many Charleston restaurants. Susan, thank you so yes, much for being course. here. And you can be found Charleston Matchbox on Instagram. Yep. And your website. And charlestonmatchbox.com. Perfect. Susan, thank yes. you so much. Thank you so much too. I'm excited.